with the new segment of grade 10 geography fourth chapter agriculture we are continuing the same chapter here today we are going to discuss about uh, food crops other than grains yes in that we have discussed already oil seeds and sugar cane the continuation of the same thing today we are going to continue or we are going to learn tea and coffee so tea it is i think you all know about that yes so tea it is known as a plantation uh, crop as well as it is known as a beverage crop it was introduced by a britishers in our country and it was developed and it is uh, in a one of the major crop in a india now for this growing purpose what it was what is required where it will be grow it will be grow in a tropical and subtropical where it is a needed well drained soil and it is a where it is a very fertile land and a well drained rain means a moving water and where that soil is present such a places the tea it will be grow very well so how the climate it will be required yes climate is very important warm frosty cold spring yes to where the warm and where we cannot see the foam or the frost free where the moisture it was not present in a cold day and the along with this growth climate the main important that is a lagos it is it is a required that's why it is known as a labor investment industry where they are needed the more labor and very skilled labor to pluck the uh, leaf of plant that is plant of tea yes so they are the needed the very trained very skilled labors to uh, in a tea plantation along with that where it will be grow in a more uh, quantity that is uh, assam darjeeling and west bengal tamil nadu kerala himachal pradesh uttarakhand meghalaya and andhra pradesh tripura so these suppose i have given some examples over there here to where they are the growing in a more quantity that is a tea and here uh, in other okay, uh, if you see these tree producing state of country in a 2015 the india was the second largest producer of tea in a when in a 2000 according to 2015 the india is uh, second largest producer of tea along with that the same uh, uh, category that is uh, coffee the coffee also it was introduced by a uh, introduced by a uh, from a yamin as a country who they are introduced to us how to grow this coffee yes so where we can get this coffee plantation it was also called as a plantation crop baba budan hills and nilgiri hills of karnataka and kerala and tamil nadu we can get a plantation of a coffee and here they will grow more in a karnataka also you can see in a uh, uttar karnataka we can see the some places they are growing the more in a tea next one is horticulture yes horti crops means they are the introducing the more larger part that is they can grow easily those fruits and vegetables but in a, the horticulture they are the are giving the more importance of the growing of fruits yes in a large quantity with the short period and with good quality fruits are available in these horticulture so here i give you some examples it will be grow very well in a way in a tropical and temperate in the sub in a warm also and in a cold also that is the tropical and temperate fruits they will grow in these uh, crops yes so where they will break, grow and which type of the fruits they will grow in a different parts of the india so first one is the mangoes is yes. the mangoes will grow in the maharashtra not only in the maharashtra 
it will be grow in a different uh, uh, place that is uh, Andhra Pradesh, Telangana, Uttar Pradesh, and West Bengal. I will give you only one more example of the each fruit. Second one, orange, Nagpur, and in a Meghalaya, banana, Kerala, Mizoram, Maharashtra, and Tamil Nadu. Lychee. It will be grown in Uttar Pradesh and uh, Bihar. Pineapple. It uh, it will be grown in uh, Meghalaya and grapes. That is in Andhra Pradesh, Telangana, Maharashtra. Apple, pea, peas, apricots, walnuts. These will be grown in a cold climate. That is uh, Jammu and Kashmir, Himachal Pradesh, and in a uh, uh, places where easily they can grow these fruits. Yes, why are they important and exporting the all over the world, even though in India they are giving the more importance for the growing of these crops. Yes, it will they are not included in the grains, even though in a, the not only in the grains, these food crops are the very important in the day to day life. So today we are learned about the tea, coffee and uh, horticulture of the growing of fruits. Yes, you just remember 10th uh, grade NCRT test of geography. Thank you.